Hello everybody. We've just been catching up on YouTube and watching Married with Children on Hulu. And in a little while here, we have to go into town. But other than that, not much is happening yet. We will be trying out those mealworms later and making a separate video for that. Which by the time you see this one, that one will already have been put up. So don't forget to check that one out. Hi White Storm. One of you cats puked all over the house last night and we don't know who. Have no idea if it was you or somebody else. But cat puke is no fun. How are you? Fine. Just eating yeah. one of your brother's homemade brownies? Yeah. Hey Kylo. And Tog. And Gizzard. Smokey is always like laid back. He doesn't really care about much. About being petted or anything. He's not mean, but he's he doesn't come asking for attention like you guys do. Here he is. Hi Smokey. And for those of you who don't know, these two are brothers. They have the same mother, even though they look completely different. They're half brothers. So we stopped here at Tom's Market, got some garlic bread to have with the spaghetti, and it is ass cold out here. It says it is 22 degrees, feels like 11, and it's starting to snow, so we're gonna go home because we're freezing to death. So now, thankfully, we are home in our nice warm house, and I'm making us spaghetti for dinner with venison hamburger, mushrooms, onions, and there's garlic powder in there, salt and pepper, minced onions. By minced onions, I mean these. We also have onion powder, but I'm not using that in here because there's real onions and minced onions. And then there will be this sauce and these tomatoes, and that's all going to go together and have a lid on it and get simmered together so all the flavor go through, goes through everything and then spaghetti of course and then this and we have, shred we have shredded cheese to put over the spaghetti when it's done so dinner will be pretty good and there's the bread looks really good Don's gonna slice it all up with that bread knife and here's the spaghetti and we will put a little bit of that on our plates. So dinner will be really good. Don't burn yourself. Hello again. It's day two now. And we still haven't tried the worms yet, the mealworms, but we will. And Don just went to town to get a roll of duct tape because I have been wanting for a couple months now to put duct tape along here because we keep getting or at least I keep getting my shirts hooked on here and my clothes all ripped up and no we can't afford to remodel the kitchen so we have to work with what we have pretty crappy old shit but anyway I'm thinking if we put a layer of duct tape, like put it on all along here with extra hanging out and then come along and fold it over, maybe we can get this crap to uh, be solid. It sucks that it has to be that way, but it does when you're not rich. There, he got duct tape, so now we have to see if we can figure this out. I mean, I have an idea of what I want to do, but... I don't want to mess it up either. Ah, you fuck everything up. What are you talking about? <laughs> Come on. You shouldn't be talking like that.
course, that's a little fucking crooked because that's what happens with me. I know bit. why, too, you, you're, because you're crooked. You want to do the rest of it? Because yeah. I, I screw everything up. Now, I don't know why you're trying to do it to begin with. Well, so you would know what my idea was. No, so that way you can waste my, my tape. No. Yeah, so that way you can waste my tape. Well, we might need to put more... You know, another piece, like starting from here and over, because I didn't really get anything back no, here. what you could have did is break that off. Oh, well, do what you want then. Take that other piece off and start over. I don't care, whatever. You have left my tape alone, woman. You do it then. <laughs> yeah, because you screw everything up. Yeah, well. Your mom could have named you Screw Up. <laughs> You're nice. I know I am. I'm an angel. There, all done. I know it's not classy, but whatever. It's for a redneck. We need to save our shirts. We keep getting holes in our shirts while we do dishes and cook food. Thank you for putting it on there, because I sure couldn't do it right. Yeah, you're just as crooked as everything else, aren't you? Oh, sure. But, anyway, that will also help it stay together, because like right here it was breaking up real bad. So, you have to deal with what you've got and we just finished making the video where we tried these so if anybody wants to know what we thought of them go ahead and watch that video if you haven't yet because by the time you see this video that video is already up our chewy delivery just came you're not excited at all are you it's a smaller box this time because we decided not to Order the dog food every single month because obviously Tug cannot eat 41 pounds of dog food a month. So we'll just order that as needed. But in the meantime, try to get this open here. for some reason one of these came out of the box but we decided to get two boxes of these a month for the cats because they really 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 like them oh this one came out all open completely they must be all over in there but anyway they're here and the cat food do you want to grab this cat food please help me out here why should I hope you will? This came open and they're all over the place, but that's all right. Come me grab the cat food. Like, here, take this too. Well, you got to get this out of the way first. What, you're not going to put them back in the box? I planned on it. Just put them on the counter and I'll put them back in the box. But well, we have their, their cat food, and four cats do eat all this cat food every month. There's some more of these. These are for the rats. And this is for Don's Placo fish. His Oscar doesn't need any more uh, food yet, but when he does, we will order that through here too. So, like I said, we'll get the dog food as needed because uh, Tug cannot eat all that food every month. No, you can't eat a full 41 pound bag. No. Not in a month. This is our third delivery, and he's only eaten half the one bag and hasn't even touched the other. Well, so. you eat better than half the one bag. Well, still. So, anyway, the cats will be happy to have so many of their squeeze-ups because they love those things. Don opened one up for him, and he wants to see how long it takes before they come running, before they smell it. 
Smells good. <laughs> He's blowing the scent at White Storm. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> he thinks it's this. That's garbage. Here comes Gizzard. <laughs> Come Kylo. Where's the uh, smoke smoke? He wasn't. Yeah, he's right there. Smokey! Wait until we all get out here. <laughs> yeah, they love these things. Come on, Gizzard, get in on it. Hey, don't eat the package, no. <laughs> So cute. Hey, you can't eat the package. <laughs> they will if you let them. <laughs> it's about gone now. Happy kitties. It looks back at the end off there. There you guys go. So let's go get another one. Yeah, no, you'll go through them too fast. Yep. If you just eat them all. And tonight we're having stir fry with chicken breast and rice. Not all of this. I'm going to make this one, the teriyaki. But I did find this at Walmart. It's in with their salad kits in the produce section. These. So far are the three flavors I tr I saw, and this is the the same as the stuff from Kroger. So it's good that somebody else has it. And when we go to Meyer in Gaylord later in the month, I'm going to see if they have some more, maybe some more flavors. Who knows? But in the meantime, at least I found some. So there, it's almost done. It's in the the phase where they want you to mix the the sauce in and then put it on low and let it sit for a little while. And I made rice in this pan. So everything will be all set and I'm sure it'll be good. So dinner was really good and I wanted to say, and I forgot to say it earlier, but if you decide to buy those stir, stir fry kits for, uh, from the produce section of whatever grocery store, don't put them in the freezer because they're meant to be cooked from fresh and it would be like putting a bag of salad in the freezer when you take it out and thaw it it's just going to be a brown slimy mess so that's why they're not frozen in the store they're supposed to be cooked from fresh but they're really good so we'll keep getting them and in the meantime I have a doctor's appointment at 1025 no not 1025 1045 tomorrow morning just for refills on my seizure medication so I need to go to bed at a decent time so I can get up and take a shower so we're gonna say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like subscribe comment share and you're having a good night say good night say good morning okay and we'll see you next time